Have you ever felt like an outsider? In the 1950s, Latinos who had to navigate different traditions, cultures, and languages faced many challenges. Julia Alvarez, an author who captured the essence of this feeling of otherness, became a prominent voice in Hispanic literature. Born in New York in 1950, Alvarez was raised in the Dominican Republic, where her father's involvement in the underground resistance against dictator General Rafael Trujillo made him a target for the authorities. Fleeing back to the United States, the family moved to Queens, New York when she was 10. Alvarez grappled with the challenges of being an immigrant, where there was a significant distinction between the customs of the Dominican Republic and the United States. This created a feeling of alienation and otherness, and she sought comfort in books, but failed to find anything to read that reflected her experiences. After studying creative writing in college, she decided to become a writer. She began her career teaching at various schools and colleges, later becoming a writer in residence at Middlebury College. The immigrant experience and cultural identity is the subject of much of Alvarez's writing. Her work crosses multiple literary forms, from poetry collections and young adult books to stories for children. Her popular first novel, How the Garcia Girls Lost Their Accents, is the story of four sisters who move from the Dominican Republic to New York and how their lives change. Her next book, In the Time of the Butterflies, gave voice to the revolutionary Mirabal sisters, weaving history with fiction. A testament to women fighting against injustice, it earned Alvarez widespread literary acclaim. Her book, Return to Sender, is a touching tale of migrant workers on a Vermont dairy farm. Julia Alvarez brought a fresh perspective to literature and integrated themes of Latin American culture through her work. Her stories shine a light on the complex interplay of history, gender, and culture. Why do you think it is important for literature to reflect and include different cultures and voices?